We should probably come prepared for the kinds of enemies we'll face. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, player. Take a look at this. Ah, damn. Is the same as defeat. Oh. oh. There's no better victory than a safe return. Nice. Kanono Island. I can, yeah, yeah. Oh, frameless glasses. Holy oh, shit. Can you say, Bloffy said? Scout ship setting. Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck, I went the total wrong direction, yeah. What do you think? Change the, change the color to like black. Better. The map's getting filled in little by little. There's still a long way to go. It's a big world out there. There's also a That's long way to go if you want to rock and roll. can happen on the waves. The far seas are unexplored territory for a reason. I'd imagine so. The seasons and the weather can change the sea completely. Oh. Do I sense a budding interest in the sea? Think you're feeling less apathetic about it now? I wouldn't say that. I was just reminded of something someone once said to me. When you walk away. What was I gonna do? Oh, I was gonna look at all the items. Let's see here, floor boots. Hard shoes. So they give you. Let's pretty much just straight defense. Some focus. Focus and defense. They don't seem that good. Yeah, they don't. And then floric earrings. Whoa. Way more attack. Art attack. Yeah. Lowers your regular attack, lowers the art defense, raises regular defense, and lowers health by a little bit. Um, she hasn't quite... I say maybe... Hold, should we hold on to them, or...? Yeah. Okay. Well, that was nifty. It's kind of cool. The assault docks. That wasn't the real I freed. But I'm glad everyone on the ship is feeling better. Yeah. Though it sounds like they never want to touch that Salatoma stuff ever again. <laughs> what about Eleanor? She took it too. And her face went all... Wah! I don't mean how she looked. I mean how she actually feels. Oh. Well, she looks like she feels better too. Good. You're worried about her, aren't you, Velvet? No, it's nothing like that. I love her. <laughs> Let me tell you something, kiddo. When young maidens ripen, they have trouble expressing their feelings. What a weird... Ripen? ripen? Mogilu, quit giving Loffy set confusing thoughts. <laughs> no trouble expressing those feelings, I see. The fuck is that? The Abbey is supposed to exist to bring peace and order to the world. Everything the Abbey does, everything Lord Melchior and Shepherd Artorius do. His name is Melchior. Is so close to melancholy. And yet, something just which is sadness. Right <laughs> you are dismissed. That knowledge is not for you. Something wrong? Uh. Whoa! Easy there. Just asking. S sorry I was just deep in thought. Is there something you need from me? Nah. Just heard a bunch of sighs and wondered if you were feeling sick or anything. No, I drank my Salatoma juice. Ah. Tasted like crap, didn't it? It... 
It wasn't that bad. They had a conversation about this already. I don't understand. It's weird. Are you afraid of demons? No, I, I am not. It's more like I despise them. Uh oh. Ten years ago. They're gonna get together. Them attacked my village. They destroyed. Everything. Calling it now. It's Velvet and Rokuro. Okay. Including your family. Yes. Yeah, I mean, the possibly. Only family I had at that point was my mother. And in all the chaos, she... I touched her for too long and she died. All I <laughs> left of her is this hand mirror she gave me. I didn't want anyone else to have to feel the way I did. And so I became an exorcist in order to destroy demons. That's why I joined the X-Men. Keep your pity. Gotcha. I will then. <laughs> Burger just doesn't care. <laughs> all right. Get that really shitty fucking cowbell out of here. It's a woodblock? Obviously. Or a really shitty cowbell, like, like I said. Like a really bad cowbell. One that sounds like a woodblock. Yeah, not a good cowbell. <laughs> what is that? Oh god, it's That's a... called a pangyon, a type of bird <laughs> native to this area. I was gonna say something like that. Pangyon. Pangyon. Their meat is succulent and tender, and makes a lovely stew. Wow, but it's so what's cute. What's it taste like? You'd eat that poor thing, savage. You want to talk, demon? Look, Eleanor. Just because you on the freaking ant flow, all right? You gotta it's chill. My mother's specialties. Fucking Eleanor on the all rag. Right. Enough of the chit chat. Magilu. What's this grimoire friend of yours like? Forgot we were even hmm. anything having to do with a grimoire. It's been so long. Oh. You know, like that. Like what? Oh. Well, to put it in a way those of meager imagination can understand. Grim's got a sort of listless, aristocratic air about her. A noblewoman in her twilight, you could say. Oh, she's older. Huh. So you mean, like, a woman, but different from Velvet and Eleanor. <laughs> You're not wrong there. <laughs> I tell you what, just keep an eye out for a grown woman. No, she's One that grown. is ripened and is almost okay. ruined. <laughs> Like a well, like a raisin. We could start by asking around. Exactly. Now you're talking. <sighs> asking around? Oh my God, Val loves it. Magilu, you're a grown woman yourself. So why is it you have trouble clearly expressing your real feelings? <laughs> Good question. Put simply, a long time ago, mine broke. Bagow! Chuck boom! Bye bye! Your feelings broke? Don't broke her heart. Come on. Let's question the townsfolk. Chaboom! Oh, it has a little a little Oh my god. Steel drums. Marumbas. It's Steel drums. There's a way you can climb down over there. Wait, what's that? Oh. Make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, shit. Dried fish. Let's go. We just, like, took their dried fish. Yeah, we technically left them there. That's a new plant. Red lavender. There's also a chest back there that you missed. Back in the town? Yeah. Seems like the first area in like an, a, a happier game. This is Destiny Island from Kingdom Hearts. I fucking knew it. <laughs> Kyrie. 
Nobody sounds like that in Kingdom Hearts. You insult me. Okay, actually, dude, I, I, I like, I legit don't see where this fucking chest is. I don't know. I don't see where it is either, but it's oh, here. Oh, okay. I thought you were actually pointing it out. Check on your far right, because there's another place you can hop down. Oh, you gotta combat it from the other way. Mm. That's kind of stupid. Eh, you know, they like to throw in weird shit like that, I guess. Okay. How do I get down? Probably over there. I mean, I was thinking that, but you know. Right there. I like this little town. Can't wait for it to get destroyed. It won't get destroyed, man. It'll get demolished. There's a cat's orb in there. Oh, shit. <sighs> There's cat's orbs in those plants, dude. Oh, shit. It's like when I say words to you, you just don't even hear them. I just interpret them differently than you expect. Like, like wrongly? Differently. Oh shit. Seventeen fifty gold. Amphible fragments. I'm glad they teleport your way over here, otherwise that would be quite the walk. Yes, yes it would. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, go talk to the explanation point. I'm just seeing if there's anything else of interest down here, so I don't have to come back. Oh shit, I'm already coming to the next one. It's also a chest. Right over there. Life bottle. Only two chests remain. Let's it's go. It's common practice to use South Gan lumber for shipbuilding, but there's a reason. Our trees really are the best for it. Natan trees only grow in South Gan. Their wood is light, tough, and doesn't rot. Perfect for shipbuilding. You know your stuff. Long ago, before people knew how to build seafaring vessels, Midgan and Southgan were separate countries. Then our ancestors fashioned rafts out of Natan logs and floated all the way to Midgan. I'm using the cat I'm technique. Amazed to see a humble raft cross the open sea. You gotta really make sure this shit's even. Here to Southgan. He had used the Natan logs to build a large, sturdy ship. Thanks to him, commerce took off between Midgan and Southgan, and the age of exploration began. The excitement of a new age had everyone floating on air, but within mere decades, Midgan declared war on Southgand. Ironically enough, it was ships made from trees from their islands that enemies used to invade them. The fighting continued for a long time, but in the end, Midgand emerged the victor. Our islands were occupied. As hard as things were, our ancestors still liked to joke about it. They'd say, Age of Exploration? More like age of exploitation. Yeah. <laughs> things were that bad, they could still joke about it. South Ganders have always been a cheerful bunch. We tend to look for the silver lining in every cloud. It may not seem like it these days, but South Gan used to be a place where the laughter would never Without cease. looking, Matt, can you South tell me how many frames that we've encoded? You looked. I did not look at the it's frames. I looked at the contest. megabytes that we uploaded. Uh, how many frames? 60 frames? Two hours? Uh, 500,000? Lower by quite a bit. 50,000? Uh, up by a little bit more. 60,000. Oh, uh, like, a little more than that. 62,000. Like, no, like, a bit more than that. Uh, 200,000. Yeah. 202,000. Oh, shit. Math. Just kidding, I didn't do any of that. Did you really think that you could... <laughs> Inch your way by that. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. Well, over here. That leads into a whole nother area. Should I check it out? Yeah. A whole nother part of the town. And it's where I have to go. A lovely seashell. Two chests remain. What the fuck are these kids doing over here? I'm king of the timber. Timber king. They thought they could hide that shit from me. Who do you think I am? They seriously didn't put anything back here? I'm so mad. They could put anything back there. Instead, they put nothing. <laughs> Which is worse. I would have been happy with some cat's orbs. At I'm least it would have felt like I was doing something. I'm alternative. <laughs> hey, man, why don't you come up here? Why don't you come down here? There's uh, the sea. I don't really like the sea. Why don't you come up here? Yeah, but... I don't really like... Wood. Elevated wood. <laughs> Still no leads on that grimoire lady. Yeah, oh, man, we haven't asked anyone. <laughs> I don't know if you're supposed to ask people. When did you get that letter from her you mentioned? They, I'm pretty sure they would have said that no matter what. Back in the year 65. Last year? A decade ago? Take this seriously or I'll feed you to the sharks. Oh, what? I think I'd at least rate a kraken. Oh, okay. Keep this up and I swear I'll eat. It's them. <laughs> the camera. Do, 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 do. The final preparations are complete. Once you've assumed your new post, everyone will act on your command. Thank you, sister. But to be honest, I worry that these shoes I'm filling might just be a bit too big for me. Mm. Let's think it over. Come back to my place. You possess a special strength and quality that others lack. Together we can trick the, take the Iron Throne. Has high hopes for your deployment to a Lannister always repays their debts. Fear not. Just be yourself and you'll do fine. Believe you're a leader, and you will be. Yes. I'll try to make you proud, sister. They're sending him to Palamedes? Is that the name of a facility on this island? I had better get going. It'd be funny if, if people started answering her back, like her, in, her internal thoughts weren't actually internal or some shit. I feel like Lavisa can hear them. Oh, yeah. Thing. Be careful around the demon and Haria. It's stronger That's than a good possibility. Else. We've even had some casualties. Understood. I have a feeling we kill him. Also, if you must drink the water, remember to boil it. Oh God, sister. Sister. I know, I know, I worry too much, but I just can't help myself. So, there's a demon in Haria. It sounds like it's a pretty feisty one, too. If so, it may prove useful. Still, what magical timing for Oscar to show up here at the very same hour we do. I understand your suspicion of me, but have you any proof? Oh, that's a good way. None, it's true. But as an exorcist, you're certainly sympathetic to the Abbey's cause. And soon you may wish we were sympathetic. But we ain't. Eleanor! Eleanor hasn't been snitching on us. I'm sure of it. And how would you know? Are you watching her even when she's taking a bath? Yeah, no. Yeah? No. No, I don't. I I always stay outside when she's <laughs> taking a bath. And then isn't it possible she's communicating with the Abbey in secret while you're not there? You pledged to obey me until the day you die, correct? Yes, that I did. Remember, when you two trade blows, only the Abbey wins. One less demon, and one less traitor for them to worry about. 
While we're standing around here arguing, that demon could be attacking Grimoire. I'm sure it's actually not happening, but it's true. Let's find some more people to question around town. All right, well, that about does it. Once we find the next save, we'll be done. <sighs> they almost found out about my secret plot to do nothing because I'm not getting any information. So what's it really like? Huh? The connection between Moloch and Vessel. Do you share, like, thoughts and feelings? Um, sort of. When I'm dwelling inside Eleanor... I can see what she sees and hear I'd like to dwell inside hears. Eleanor, if you know what I'm saying. Can't read her thoughts or her emotions. <laughs> like crawl up inside. I guess you can't read her thoughts. The box doesn't teach you how the box feels. I see. In That's that a weird case, analogy. As little time alone as possible. Uh, I don't want to bathe with her, all right? I know. You're a boy and all. For her baths, we can Oh, really? Mm -hmm. He's a boy? Yeah. It'll have to she be just misspoke, dude. For myself. What sort of boundaries have you and Eleanor drawn? How do you sleep? We the Republican kind? Sometimes. It's really confusing. But it's not like I'm sleeping by her side or anything. It's easier for me to tell when she wakes up if I'm dwelling inside her. Does she ever get out of bed? <laughs> it sounds so creepy. Not in my experience. And she sleeps so peacefully. Huh? When she's around you guys, she always looks so stern. But when she's sleeping, her expression is... Softer, you could say. She lets her hair down too, and I think it's kind of prettier that way. Huh. So that's mm. what he likes. Lesbian. Well, keep an eye on her, but. But? Watch out for the older girls. Huh? Okay. Teresa and Oscar sure seem close. <laughs> I've known them since I was an initiate. I've never seen them quarrel, <laughs> even once. Did you ever fight with your brother, Velvet? Yeah, I guess I did. Sometimes I'd chew him out, and he'd sulk and stop talking to me, but I found that adorable too. You did? No matter how much he dug in his heels, or tried to talk like he was in charge, after a while he'd be right there trailing along behind me. Like a little puppy dog. Puppies are a lot more obedient. I always had to keep an eye on him. Little brothers are odd creatures. Oh my god, she's showing happiness. Brother, is he adorable too? Huh? I didn't think a little brother who's out to kill you was in any way adorable. But Chigurei seemed like he was having fun. He probably thinks Rokuro looks adorable. just don't make sense. Huh? I don't know. <laughs> little brothers. Do you have any siblings? I'm an only child. Well then, that's perfect. You pretend the boy is your little brother. Huh? That's a bit extreme, but actually, when I'm talking with Lobby Set. Oh god, Bella's gonna be oh. so pissed. This is what having a brother must feel like. I could be Eleanor's brother. Uh. Don't take any of this nonsense seriously, Lobby Set. You're my brother. You are just tools to exorcists. She can never think of you as her brother. Oh, yeah. You're wrong. I've changed how I view Malachi. But not how I view demons. I still despise them. Even though I'm aroused by Rokuro's presence. Right. She's all talk. Don't believe her. By forcing your own opinions upon him. Ooh. Two sisters struggling for the affections of their brother. Eeny teeny candlestick. Which one will the Muppet pick? Muppet? An older brother instead. Was like, I'll be your brother. Always want a little brother. Teach him how to sword fight and all that. Where the fuck is the save point? Oh god, no, I gotta go into another area where there's more I'm story. I'm sure you can just go into that inn right there. The one right here? Yeah, the, oh, yeah. the one that says all at the top there. Yo, this place doesn't have a save point? Are you fucking me? Alright, well, we'll just pretend it's a save point. Quick save. Oh, I don't really want a quick save. But I guess I have to. Alright, gang. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're going to call it a stream here. If you're watching us on YouTube, you can catch us live every Monday.
at 7 p.m. Pacific time on twitch.tv slash TV. If you're watching this live, all of our VODs do go up on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash TV. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.